everybody, welcome to the Operation 18 Podcast. I'm Dane, and I'm here with Steven. What's up? Good morning. Let's get lit. Dude, I got fucking AIDS in my ass, dude. <laughs> All There's right. never a better time. Topic number one. Sea doggo. Big boys. Big boys, what are we talking Express about? Express your opinion on the Logan Paul boy. Because we got to do it, dude. We got to get them views. Unlike Logan, <laughs> I don't get views. Dude, holy shit, dude. You're being too real for us, dude. All right, you got to calm you down. You got to talk about Logan. I can't talk about I'm Logan. I'm going to start throwing up what I just ate. Those three if slices of toast that you thought was too much, I'm going to start throwing up. <laughs> <laughs> if I don't start talking about Logan. Yes. Talk about so, it. Cuck. To anybody, to anybody that doesn't know, Logan Paul went to. They Japan. know. They know. I'm just clarifying. Dude, okay? my grandma knows. <laughs> Logan Paul went to the suicide force in Japan, filmed Shut a dead up, body, I'm explaining it. and he got big boy trouble. So he went to uh, just Japan in general, and he was, you know, uh, recording vlogs and whatever he does. And he went into the suicide forest uh, at the bottom of Mount Fuji, which is, you know, people go there to commit suicide. It's Dude, I would have never guessed. Very well. Oh. You don't need to explain then, it. Just give off your opinion. Everybody in, already knows. I'm not. He, then he went in and then he uh, recorded a dead body, put it up on YouTube. And biggest issue I have is that if anybody else decided to do that, because YouTube had to man, manually, not manually, but automatically, basically, um, say that that video could be put on YouTube for however long it was, however many hours it was on. And the thing that makes, that aggravates me the most is that if anybody, if any other account did that, like any other account that wasn't as big as his, they would immediately been... The video wouldn't have passed through. It would have been immediately terminated, and their account probably would have been, you know, some something happened to it. But since Logan Paul makes so much money for YouTube with all the ads on his videos and how big his fan base is, it would. That's why it got passed through. That's why um, it happened. Unless there was a malfunction for whatever reason for YouTube stuff, which I highly doubt that because. You know, it's it's just a fact that Logan Paul is making all like a lot of money for him. Same with uh, Jake Paul too, You're making money. But if if like some other account, let's say, um, what other account can I use? I'm playing Minesweeper <clears throat> right now, <laughs> like the old classic one. God damn I went it. through and like I'm, installed I'm, the. I'm debating right now. What? Uh, let's take, let's take a smaller account, like, um, uh, Colossus. Let's take him. Colossus? If he did it, yeah. Who's Colossus? Or Colossal or whatever. Colossal is crazy? Yeah, Colossal is crazy, that's, that's him. If we take, if we take his account and he did it, which I know he wouldn't, because why the, why the hell would he? But if he did it, then it would probably be an, ex like, immediately terminated his account probably would have been you know uh striked or something like that like immediately dude i suck at minesweeper <laughs> god damn it stop playing i haven't played it in so long god damn it anyway blah blah, blah. uh youtube i feel like right now it's not even much of like that big of a deal for logan probably it's more of like YouTube's problem now because I saw this like article that someone wrote which already I had my doubts about the article because they said that YouTube was founded in 2004 which I mean it only takes maybe two seconds to look up YouTube on Google and the first thing that comes up is founded 2005 in February yeah. February 14th I think so I'm a, I'm so, sorry. so you know, I mean, it didn't take that long to research the year. <laughs> anyway, so the article's like, uh, I don't even know what that was, by the way. What you just I, did. I don't know what it was either. Like, that wasn't a sneeze. I, like, coughed it out. Anyway. Uh, yeah, so, February, February 14, 2005. 
All right, so the article's like, so you know how like Facebook went through the whole like being trashed on basically the whole year last year? Yeah. It's like this year they're saying that's going to happen to YouTube because YouTube's doing such a poor job of managing their platform, which honestly I have to agree because you stop. I'm going to nut. So basically I feel like YouTube has gone from like, sorry, I have to burp. Um, YouTube has gone from treating everybody equally so, like, if someone broke the terms of service, they would p- penalize them accordingly. Mm. Yeah. But, like, bigger creators like Logan Paul, like, the fact that his video was reviewed for, like, a flag, and then the guy who reviewed it, an actual human reviewed it, and then it got approved to stay on the platform, that's kind of, yeah. like... That's where... That's it's where really that's shady. Because, like, if that was, like you said, anybody, they would have gotten probably either like a strike or they would have just gotten all out terminated but yeah. since Logan Paul makes YouTube so much money they feel obligated to give him some lenience which mm-hmm. I mean I don't care give a creator lenience if you want to because you think he's more important than everybody but the fact that you gave him that much lenience yeah. is kind of like it just shows where your morals are at it's like how celebrities in Hollywood the ones that like preach this like male like all these males that are like oh yeah feminism and all that and then it turns out they've raped like 16 women or they've sexually harassed all these women in Hollywood it's like that kind of hypocrisy Mm -hmm. how YouTube tries to spread this message of like we're trying to keep the platform clean and if you don't like that then we'll kick you off and then they just give someone like Logan Paul all of this leeway yeah makes me mad it's Dude, it makes me get issue. big boy feelings. Oh, gay boy feelings? Mm-mm. <laughs> big boy feelings. I mean, I'm yeah. The big, big, the, the big man. <laughs> the big man. The big man. The biggest issue, honestly. The biggest man, that. honestly. Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> you mind? Go ahead. Uh, the biggest... The... That is definitely the biggest issue, would be why would they give him that much lenience? Yeah. And why would why would they even give them lenience like that? No matter if it's, you know, they shouldn't be giving lenience to special people. I know. Screw those like, autistic people, dude. Well, I mean, it's like... <laughs> you said special people. <laughs> I like that. But like... See if, well, I'm not going to use analogies anymore, but, you Use know, an analogy. That's just, the only way I understand. If a dog, <laughs> but, um, it's just, it's to the point where, why would you give lenience at all when you specifically have rules and stuff like that that say that you can't do that? Yeah. And if you're going to have lenience on that one person, you're going to have lenience on everyone. Mm-hmm. And not just, you know, because then you're being hypocritical of the thing that you've already made. Because you made that, I don't know when, just forever, forever ago when you made the terms and services, you're just automatically going to... Well, they updated them like three years ago. Yeah. I remember when they updated them and I was like, oh, I'm not going to read it. <laughs> and then they updated it again, I think, like a couple years ago because of the whole demonetization thing. Like, yeah. remember a couple of years ago, because I think Keemstar said something like this on a podcast. Um, he was like, apparently when YouTube implemented, like, the yellow, like, golden dollar sign to show that yeah. your video has limited ads, the only difference between now and then was that now they actually tell you when your video is getting demonetized. Which, yeah. if you remember, that was a big complaint with people. Because they people used to complain all the time how they thought their video was not getting monetized because it was making less money than mm-hmm. another video, but it still showed the green dollar sign. Yeah. So you know YouTube implements a system of like monetization, uh, mm-hmm. showing that you have limited ads, and now people are mad. 
so I mean I don't know they changed the terms of service a lot and then people the exact thing that people are asking for people just don't like it and it's like can you just make up your mind yeah it gets it's getting fucked every day why'd you just link me a YouTube channel why no I know what that is <laughs> why oh that doesn't even exist anymore I know, but Dude, it's what still... happened to him? He died, I think. <laughs> Save that. <laughs> Dude, I'm pretty sure. What he was his name died. again? Blazing Panther. No, what was his actual name? Ty or Justin? Justin. Or something like that? Yeah. Dude, where's Justin now? My Justin? No. That just oh, I still get a dude. lot of flack on that video. Like a what lot of video? people comment like I remember I got this one guy that commented, I, I'm assuming he's probably like nine. He's like, how dare you? Blah, 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 rip the tail off that poor iguana. And I'm like, dude, it's not even me that did it. Yeah. Like, I had to put a disclaimer in the description saying it wasn't me. It was my friend. get mad cousin. at anyone, get mad at me because I was the one who gave the video. No, basically. if anything, get mad at your cousin because he's the one who ripped the tail off. He would have ripped the tail off regardless if you were recording. He him. didn't He didn't rip rip the tail off it kind of it fell off that's a defense mechanism so it's not like he actually ripped it off yeah but still the way he was acting acting was I'm still not saying though i i think it's like except if any if anybody should be blamed it's your cousin because i mean yeah. regardless if you were recording or not that probably would have still happened so like i'm going down to that video if you want anybody to blame blame a 10 year old yeah he's Isn't 11 he like now, 10 dude. He's 11 now. Hmm. He might be 10 now. Yeah, I think he was like 9 He was 10 because he was 7 yeah. in the video. Oh, yeah, 7. Yeah, because I put his age in the title. Remember uh, that? I exploited his age for views. <laughs> Young little <laughs> bitch boy. Whoa. Chill out, dude. dude he's fat now. <laughs> I'm not even playing, dude. Yeah, I'm not even playing, man. He is Did you, freaking No, the video man, the video man. on my channel, you could see him. Yeah. Did you see how big he was? How much does he weigh? <laughs> one twenty five. Why do you know that? Oh, one twenty five! Jesus yeah. Christ, he's only ten. I know. I'm fifteen and I'm a hundred forty five pounds. I'm 16, I'm 210. What are you trying to say here? <laughs> I'm 60. Dang, I'm dude, you got a senior citizen on the podcast. <laughs> I said I'm 16. But you said you're 60. That's why I I'm laughed. 16. Minecraft Murder Season 3 with Stephen, Chris, and Jordan. Stop. <laughs> I found Jordan. it. From oh, girl Jordan. Yeah, wrecked by 8-year-old. Iguana gets wrecked by 8-year-old. Yeah. Dude, I watched my old channel trailer from... Goddamn Gintro, hell yeah. Yeah, dude. I watched my old yeah. channel trailer from two and a half years ago. Stop watching the video. Why I'm did trying somebody to have a comment, podcast. this is scared? <laughs> I don't know. Dude, you got wrecked by that iguana. You went running. I know. <laughs> I read that during a reading comments video. And I was just like, what? <laughs> Mm. So how sick and twisted that's animal abuse. You never pick up an iguana by his tail. This video, this video disgusts me to the core. I feel so bad for this Iggy. <laughs> Iggy. <laughs> no. Okay. It did not deserve Stop. to be screwed around by by a stupid little kid. I'm trying to make some points. Pig crap. <laughs> so I was rewatching my old. Uh... My old channel trailer yeah. from a long time ago, and it's actually it it holds up in humor. I, I I laughed a few times. Like if my content hadn't changed, I would have still I would still be promoting that channel trailer. Yeah, that's true. It's pretty good. I mean, like I left in like a clip of you um like when I punched you in the game and you went. Whoa! Oh yeah, that's like one of my all time favorite clips. Yeah. So. I don't know.
Yeah, I also cringe out a lot though at my old content. I do too. Whenever I watch like my old. Well, stuff. I have like I have like personal reasons, like in like my personal life this happened or this was going on in my personal life, so I shouldn't have said something like that. Like when Aaron, like when you got, you and Aaron were still a thing back then, and then now you guys are a thing now, and like stuff like that. Well, like uh, the way that I would like talk to her in my old videos, I, I cringe oh, yeah. out because it's like I acted very um. I guess like sexual. No, definitely not. <laughs> or me. No, I acted like a a bit of an a hole. Like, I I think in one of the videos I actually ended up calling like I indirectly called her ugly. Mm. As like a joke. Yeah. But like looking back on that, that's kind of stupid. I, I, I kind of like bossed her around a lot whenever it came to making videos because I used to make my videos very organized. So like yeah. there would be I, there would be like an intro and we would do the video and then there'd also be an outro that I you would kinda say. Like, you kind of followed the uh, the whole uh, whole rise and fall in uh, like literature. Like the starting point, the rise in action, the yeah. climax, the falling action. Yeah, uh, like my videos story. had structure. Uh -huh. Had story structure, even though there was no story. Yeah. But so I mean, like, like I, I would be like, hey, Aaron, let's do an intro. And then she's like, all right. And then I'd be like, three, two, one. And then she would mess up and I'd get mad. And I'm like, well, yeah. looking back on it, it's like, well, she's not a YouTuber. Mm -hmm. She's just this girl that I had maybe met six months before I'm recording this video. She's probably not very familiar with how this works. Yeah. Like, I had to put that into account. Mm -hmm. Like, nowadays, if I were to do a video with her, there would, wouldn't would really be an intro. Like, it would just be the, like, edited up, jumbled up video that I usually do. Because that's kind of my style now. Oh, well, yeah. I'll roll, like, the, the actual intro, and then it'll cut to, like, clips that I've yeah. mashed up and edited. And then it'll roll out, like, the outro that I have. That's it. Like, I never say anything. Um, I don't... I, I try to, like... I try my best not to directly address the audience. Yeah. Because I feel like you can immerse yourself better if it's just purely entertainment instead yeah, of, like, true. pandering to the audience. I mean... Yeah. So that's kind of how my content's evolved, like, on a personal level and on a, a outside perspective. I try yeah, to talk content. to Aaron about that, too, and she, like... She's like, dude, I don't care. <laughs> yeah. But I'm I'm sure if I were to send her a link to one of those videos, she would soon realize, like, oh, maybe I should have cared. <laughs> mm -hmm. Honestly, with my content, it's very... It, I change a lot because I want to do one thing, and then I eventually get bored of it, and I want to do another thing, and then I get bored of that, and I want to do another thing. Like with, like how I used to be, I used to, uh, like, say I'm looking at my channel now, my Hill the Bassman channel. Yeah. Three years ago, I used to play Minecraft and stuff like that, which, you know, as anybody... Is that Hill the Bassman, Bassman channel still the same one that you used to use, or is it just a new one? It's, it's the same one. Oh, so I still have the login information to it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I've probably lost it. But you yeah. have given me the login at one point. Because you just didn't want to use it anymore. Um, yeah. And that's another issue. Is that I I did Minecraft for a while. And for some reason when I was younger, I was a lot more consistent than when I am now. Like, when I was younger, I went a solid three years just... Oh, Jesus. Uh, just constantly posting. Let's see. I posted... Uh, how many is in... Six, one, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight Whoa. times six, however many that is. Forty-eight. Forty or forty-nine videos on here were all consistent. In, oh. in that span, three years, ago or three years ago. Forty-nine videos are just all consistent. Now you're like fishing, then, or you're doing ASMR, yeah. or you're doing video games. And it went from me playing video games on here to like vlog stuff and then to fishing and then to ASMR and then to more games with trying to stream. 
and then going to Pokemon and then going to Minecraft again and then going back to Call of Duty and then CSGO and then, you know, then now we're back with fishing. Yeah. And it just, it's changed so much and I don't know, I don't know. Yee. I don't know, I've always uh, been approached about my uh, methods of making my channel look professional, which... I mean, yeah, I can see, like, how making my channel look really professional can be kind of dumb. Because, I mean, he, he, like, just bluntly said to me, uh, dude, nobody's watching your channel. And I was like, oh, uh, well, I kind of know. I just don't like to admit it to myself. Note that this is a fellow content creator that yeah. I know in real life that does YouTube. Like, he knows the game like I mm -hmm. do, so... A 24-7 grind? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It's just... Uh, like... This went from talking about Logan Paul's hard cock to now... Yeah, uh, our content. Our, because our we're content. pissed off at YouTube. You want to yeah. know, like... Because a lot of people don't know my history on YouTube. Uh... Which is why, like, anytime, like, a whole YouTube controversy comes up, I get super mad. Yeah. And then people are like, we should leave YouTube and band together, make a new website. And it's like, that would take so long. Yeah. And uh, it's not worth like, it. Like, what you said, it's, it's, a uh, um, right now with, uh, YouTube, it took, uh, it's been since two, uh, 2005. In February, which soon is going to be the um, 13th year anniversary of yeah. YouTube. And that's a long time. That's 13 years of building a website. And I'm trying to improve on it and stuff yeah. like that. All so right, let me tell my history, dude. i got to tell the BCs, the 80s, the, the CDs. Then the queef queefs? No. So, my history on YouTube is basically 2009 to now. Mm -hmm. So, like, I'm, like, on, like, some Keemstar level stuff. Yeah. I've been on YouTube for nine years. So, try to put that, try to conceptualize that in your head. Yeah. So, basically, it's, like, in a way, I feel like I've basically grown up with this platform. So, every time, like, a new controversy comes up, I'm, like, like, what are you doing? Mm -hmm. I remember when the subscribe button was on the top of the video. Yeah. And it was still yellow. <laughs> I didn't even know what subscribe meant. I just saw it and knew mm -hmm. it was there. So, you know, I you know, I would watch like the, the the other thing that also got me mad was hearing about in the time that I left uh YouTube cuz I the whole year of 2012 I didn't really use it. It yeah. was really disappointing to hear that I think like around that time they implemented the new algorithm where shorter videos would get kind of butchered and not promoted yeah. because longer content was more favorable. Mm -hmm. Which I think they did that to like prevent spam, I think they said it was. Mm. But like that Those are also reasonable. like conks, like animators and stuff like that, which I used to watch uh, stop motion animation yeah. on YouTube, which... The the only creator that I can remember being subscribed to, uh, and this is a really Tyler cool Lane. thing because I actually remember when he released this certain really popular video. I used to be subscribed to Forest Fire Films, or First Forest Fire One Hundred One, or whatever his channel oh, his yeah. name is. Yeah, I know who you you know the guy who made the Duck Song. Yeah. I remember when the Duck Song came out. Okay, mm. <laughs> I saw it in my feed. <laughs> but like before that I would like watch all of his stop motion animations like his Lego Batman stuff and that was really cool and I still kind of go yeah. back and watch it every now and then but just like content like his because I don't think he actually uploads very often anymore I think he uploads like twice a year which was Jeez. really sad I think the last big thing that he did was an epic rap battle of history <laughs> he did the Thor versus Zeus one so you know, it it was kind of sad to see a YouTuber fall mm -hmm. like that because of YouTube's doing. That was like my first 
sign of me being sad at something YouTube was doing. But, like, YouTube went on a pretty long streak of doing a pretty good job. Mm-hmm. Like, uh... Until Susan got in. Like, YouTube Comedy Week was kind of funny. Uh, they did, like, the, the Gregory Brothers did, like, a song about the history of YouTube, which that song almost turns five years old soon. Uh, Jesus, which, okay. there's a gag in the video where it's like, oh, it's 2018, I'm retired. And it's now 2018, so... He's retired. Mm -hmm. And I tweeted at him saying, aren't you retired now? So that was kind of funny. But then, you know, YouTube did, like, the YouTube gaming and yeah, they, like, improved how live streaming works, uh, all that stuff. Mm -hmm. They got rid of the star rating system, yeah, like, like a long time ago. And stuff like that? Like, the star rating, where you could give it, like, a five star or something. Yeah. That was uh, interesting. And then there's also, like, the favoriting type deal. I remember one of the first uh, major mess-ups that happened that I didn't really care about all that much was the Google Plus integrating system. How you yeah. had to have Google Plus to comment on videos, which for the first couple months, yeah, that was a bit of an issue with me because I signed up for a new account right before they did that. Yeah. So I couldn't actually comment on anything. But... I mean, I mean it's fine. Like when I made the day nine one seventy six account, it had Google Plus, so I could actually comment. But uh, I, I, I could tell that was like the first sign of people really getting angry. Yeah. The Google Plus thing. I think that's when like Google started implementing their will on mm -hmm. YouTube. Their way. The, the way. The last huge thing they Google did to YouTube was implement Susan as their new CEO. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. You know what's funny about that? What? I did a research project on the founders of Google, and I had to, I did it like twice, and I found yeah. out that one of the founders' ex-wife's, uh, his ex-wife's uh, sister is Susan, mm. the CEO of YouTube. Damn. And I was like, that's kind of funny. Because they also split up that same year that Susan became the CEO. <laughs> Susan's Susan ruined it all. Funny. I don't know. Susan, that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Let's talk about something else. I'm done. YouTube Rewind. No! I didn't even yes. watch it. Or I did, it's but like I don't remember it. Awful. Do you want to do a React video right now? No! No, I don't care about the YouTube Rewind. That's old stuff. Uh, <laughs> Someone took oh the yeah, Connect 4 box cool. and wrote Connecticut on it. <laughs> Someone posted, got a whole babe in my lunch. Got a whole cock in my lunch. Yeah. Ew, that guy's in my au used to be in my audio class. Hey, uh, Dane, how's all, the, how's all that rain feeling? Great. You enjoying it? Uh huh. I actually like rain. I like it when it rains. So. Well, it's raining right now, you idiot. Look yeah. outside. I like it. Dude, there's a seventy percent chance of frozen mix today. Good. Uh, what do you think about that razor phone that came out a couple months ago? A razor phone. Like yeah, a razor. You know what razor is, right? Like the scooters? No. <laughs> <laughs> like the keyboards. The scooters? The keyboards that unnecessarily make really loud clicking noises. Yeah, I know who you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, Chris has one and it pisses me off. It's all I can ever hear whenever I'm in a Discord call with him. We'll be playing a game and all you hear is just like... <laughs> and all he's doing is moving like two feet in front of him. <laughs> it's so annoying. And then he goes to type a message in chat and that's when that's the moment where I need a hearing aid. That's when you have a seizure. I know. No, but Razer made a new phone, and it's just a rectangle with pointy corners. Seems pretty neat to me. Yeah, I, I I haven't seen anything about it. I just hope it's, like, a good phone. I would hope it is, because that would be a good option to get that's not Apple. I guess. I'm really disappointed with Apple. Why? Uh, like, my phone dies at, like, 60%. Uh, that's just your phone. No, what that's kind of literally phone? iPhone. It happened on my previous iPhone as well. What kind of phone do you it have? It happened on Alex's old iPhone. And then he what got kind of phone do you have? Answer my Success! Name. Dude, that's why. You have to get a 6. Dude, 
Alex had like a five, and then I had a four S before my fo- my current phone. All of them would start doing that, and now Alex has an S eight. Alex is one of the hosts of this podcast, and he left my Discord. <laughs> and I was like, "What are you doing? <laughs> like, can you not be a boy?" <sighs> right. Yeet. Ooga booga. Don't do this again. Ooga booga. I'm gonna go on Twitter and find crazy. a topic. Talk about something before I rudely interrupt you with a topic. Ooga booga bad bitch crazy. Wait, uh, how long is this video so far? Like 30 minutes. That's long enough. No, it's not. That yeah, is. No, it's not. We can go to an hour. I, I like to go to an hour. Dude, let's just start talking about something while I'm looking for a I'm topic. I'm only horny for men. Let's talk about the gays. <laughs> Let's talk about the gays. The fuck is this, dude? Sledgehammer Games, dude. What's coming out? What is this? What the hell is this? I just saw a tweet saying soon. Apparently, uh, Tyler1 broke Twitch. Apparently, he just reached a... Um, hold on. Tyler1 has smashed uh, Faker's Twitch viewership record uh, before he played a single game of League of Legends. Tyler1's current, like, viewers right now is almost 300,000. That doesn't seem like much of a record. I thought Dr. Disrespect has gotten way higher than that. On what? Twitch. Yeah, apparently Tyler1 just, like, destroyed Twitch, because Tyler1's been gone for a long time. Yeah. So he just, like, started streaming all of a sudden and uh, just completely destroyed the platform. How many people did, like, do you know? It says almost 300,000. It's, like, 271 no. or something. Um, I could have sworn, though, somebody's gotten a higher amount of viewers. Dr. Disrespect and... has. Yeah, that's what I thought. It was, it was close to 4,000. Or 400,000. It was close. The dog. But it was like... Oh, never mind. Now he has almost 400,000 viewers. Yeah, the tweet that I read was from like an hour ago. So this, the one that I just read that says 400,000 is from like 20 seconds ago. Oh, shit. Then yeah, he's, he's getting He has a pass. million total followers on Twitch. He's trending on Twitter. Well, that's also dog, too. Dude, Doc left a couple, like a few weeks ago, though. Yeah, I know. Because of the whole thing. Mm-hmm. That was a weird situation. I didn't even really hear all that much about it. I just kind of... Well, because I think he like exposed himself before anybody else could. Because he wanted to like soften the blow. Let me actually... I'm going to search that up really quick. Oh, yeah. Georgia... Uh, Georgia is... Georgia born. Bulldogs versus Alabama today. 7 p.m. Let's go. <laughs> 7 p.m. Eastern. Tune in tonight. That's literally what it is. I'm going to make sure to upload this podcast before 7 p.m. just so you can boast about... <laughs> yeah, I'm watching the Doctor Football. Disrespect thing. Oh. Wow, this is a great podcast. Just total 30 seconds of silence. Uh... Blah, blah, blah. Oh. I guess like a Major League Baseball dog died. A bat dog. Bulldog. No, it was like a dog that retrieves a bat. Bulge dog. Dude, I don't care about dogs in the... Uh, whatever the National Baseball League is called. Oh, MLB. I don't care. I'm a sports boy. God, give me some good tweets. I just am getting a bunch of, like, stuff suggested to me of from, like, people that have retweeted stuff from just these stupid accounts. All right, damn. God. 
I just saw a Toyota tweet just a second ago. Where'd it go? <laughs> Toyota. Yes. Eat I'm not even asses. on the right Twitter. That's why. I'm on my personal account. Mercedes-Benz Stadium is a trending thing right now. Why? Oh, there's that tweet about my school system being a being big gay. boy. Oh, my God. There's a, there's a trending uh, hashtag right now. I may have overreact, overreacted when... Literally, there's a, just a tweet of a guy punching a bush. Here, I'm gonna this is looking it. like a very feminine thing. What do you mean? The I may have overreacted one. What are you talking about? The It's a trending thing. Right now, a tweet. What are you talking about? I may have overreacted when... Oh, I see Some it. of them seem like... Oh. Uh, I gave birth. I apologize for the screaming and crying. Yeah. Uh, yeah, why is it just a bunch of women tweeting it? I don't know. There's like a couple Dude, Do you dudes, see the Samsung but... uh, uh, XCS? Or uh, XCES? What? The new uh, TV. I don't give a crap about TVs. Dude, yeah. it looks so crispy. What is the Vive Pro? <laughs> yeah! Stop. What? The I Vive see, Pro. Sorry. HTC has a new high-res Vive Pro VR headset. I don't care about Vive VR. Dude, I love me some Vive. <laughs> some Vive. Some VR porn? No, I just love Vive. I love it when I thought it said Vine, which is why I actually got kind of hyped, because I was like, oh, I'm interested in what new garbage Vine's going to come up with. The only reason Matt. I'm excited for Vine 2, 2 is because I think it's going to crash and burn. Uh, Vine Pro. <laughs> Vine. Vive Pro. Speaking of Vine, uh, a lot of people are asking like what Vine 2 is going to look like. It's probably literally just going to be like the old Vine, just with ads. The old, the old Vine, just with the big old number 2 on the side of it. And with ads. Because the old Vine didn't have ads, I don't think. Like, the old Vine couldn't make any money because they never put any ads on it. Really? Yeah. I don't know, like, how far along we are with VR. But 3K doesn't seem like that big of a deal. They're like, the only issue has... with, like, yeah, making things in 4K... Very minimal people can actually play it or watch it. This in headset's 4K. built to be in 4K. A headset? <laughs> or 3K, I mean. It's built to be in 3K. <laughs> like, Cause we can't like the make audio a... is going to be in. Because we can't make two screens inside of a headset 4K. Can't just increase the amount of pixels. Yeah. It would take longer, but I mean, it's. I'm sure it's possible. I like how I'm complaining about all this new age technology. See the whole thing with the Secret Service? I'm just hoping for like an adult to walk in here and be like... Oh, yo, today it says firefighter injured a Trump Tower rooftop fire spotted by Secret Service. Trump Tower. Trump Tower. Goddamn lit. Dude, it's lit at Trump Tower. Does that say make America gay again? Please say that it doesn't. It does! Who did Trump br uh, blame for the fire? It doesn't say anything. Has he tweeted he hasn't blamed anything him. about it? Oh, God. I just read one tweet from him, and it starts off with African-American. Jesus. Good. African-American unemployment is the lowest ever recorded in our country. The Hispanic unemployment rate dropped to a full point in the last year and is close to the lowest in recording history. Dems did nothing for you but get your vote. I feel like there's a, so much retardation in that one tweet alone that I don't even want to get into it. He I'm just said, he just said that the true, Hispanic yeah. unemployment rate dropped a full point in the last year, the year that he's been president, and then he blamed it on the Democrats, even though the, his party has control of most of everything in Washington. Didn't blame the Democrats. He just, he just did. That. 
Dems did nothing for you but get your vote. That That's doesn't make any sense. Basically saying that the He's Hispanics expecting voted, the minority in the for, House and Senate to help them? Voted for Democrats, but they aren't going to do anything for them. That's what that's trying to say. Uh, then he's over here ranting about what it would have been like. Uh, he's ranting about like, hey, look at this New York Post uh, article about why we're better off with Trump than Clinton. And then he's just bragging about all this stuff. Uh, get off Twitter, please. I honestly, I would hate him much less if he just wasn't on Twitter. Can I just, like, say that right now? It's not even the fact that, like, the stuff that he does can be retarded sometimes. It's just that he seems more focused on like defending himself on Twitter than he is on other things. If he just didn't have a Twitter account, I'd feel much better about him being in the White House. Yeah. That's my opinion. Supreme Court will not stop Mississippi law allowing discrimination against gay people. Good job. <laughs> yeah. Get rid of the gays. <laughs> Get rid of the gays. Yep. So there's a new uh, causing Fuel too cup. much. There's a new G Fuel shaker cup. Dude, I kind of want to get motherfucking G Fuel, dude. I don't. You know what I want? I don't Milkshake. Know. I don't want no freaking gaming energy drink. Gaming. The only game one that lady. seems like it would be good is the strawberry shortcake one. You mean Phase Apex flavor? It's literally called Strawberry Shortcake. Yeah, that's so Phase Apex. So they they didn't name it something pretentious like Nade Shots Lemonade. Freaking gay boy! I don't want any other Nade Shots Lemonade, dude. Let me look at all the flavors really quick. Nade Shots Lemonade. There, strawberry doesn't, Shortcake. Doesn't Jeff have one? No. I thought he got one recently, or not recently, no, but like a while ago. He doesn't have one. Are you sure? Yeah, he doesn't. Good. Where do I look? Just the G Fuel website for every flavor? Yeah. Honestly, the peach iced tea one is probably the one I'm going to get. I don't I'm care about the caffeine. Anything. I just want to know the freaking flavors. Rainbow Sherbert Tub. There's a... Uh... God bless America. Um... Excuse me, could I just, like, look at your products? Stop. Okay, tubs. There's three different ones, that are or four different ones that are specific. Okay, There's a strawberry shortcake. Strawberry shortcake. I uh, Peach iced tea, rainbow sherbet, cherry limeade, lemonade, tropical rain, uh, phase berry, which is, like, the gayest name on the planet, blue ice tub, uh, kiwi strawberry, um, watermelon, peach mango, pink lemonade. That one actually sounds. That one sounds pretty good. Uh, green apple, blood orange, fruit punch, mystery, uh, lemon lime, grape, pineapple, coconut, and orange, which is caffeine free. Probably the ones that I would like the most would probably be the pineapple one, lemon lime. Uh, fruit punch, peach mango, maybe tropical rain because like I like the assortment of berries. I think uh, the ones peach. that I would try is probably strawberry shortcake, uh, the tropical rain one, uh, probably pink lemonade, and um. Grape and pineapple. Jeb, dude. Grape and pineapple. What? Yo, you gotta do uh, code S7 for Smitty. I don't care. How much would I, that? How I probably would use a referral be? code. I only, I would only use referral codes because I'm thinking of me, not the person who made the referral code. Yes. Yeah, like I used a referral code. 
I used a referral code er earlier for Rooster Teeth first. I just used the Sugar Pine 7 referral code. Because that was like the only one that I could actually think of. Wait, where do you even use a referral code? <laughs> In the checkout. Hey, let me, when you're let me checking a... out, and you enter like all your information yeah. and it asks if you have a referral code. Each iced tea. And then it'll like give you your total oh, after I it's cut off. I don't want two of them. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Are you actually buying one? Fucking hell, I want one. No, I don't want two, okay, boy. What do you want, peach iced tea? Dude, iced tea is gross. Well, it's not. Dude, sweet tea is nasty, I'll tell you that. Is it? No, sweet tea is good, you I, idiot. We live in Georgia, and I think sweet tea tastes like shit. We're not Georgian. No, Dude, I don't like grits either. What are you going to do about it? I swear to God, dang. <laughs> What's another southern food? Fried okra? Yeah, I don't like that either. Don't make me kill myself. <laughs> I will. What are other southern foods that are just exclusive to the south? I know like Chick-fil-A is for the most part exclusive to the south, and I love Chick-fil-A. So. Oh, dude, using a referral code only gives you like two, three dollars off. Yeah. That's still two or three dollars you're getting to keep though. That's true. Goddamn yeah. white gravy. I swear to god if you say you don't like I white don't gravy. like white gravy, no. You're not my friend anymore. <laughs> uh no, I'm just very selective and picky. Like a Tobacco. lot of the, like a lot of the stuff that I order I order plain because I'm just very picky with the stuff that I eat. I don't like combining things. I also don't like vegetables. That's probably why I also order a lot of things plain. <sighs> Gotta get strong, Dane. I like fruit. Fruit tastes good because it's sweet and it's actually digestible. Vegetables, for the pretty much, you can never like digest most of vegetables, and actually, you can. They're always like super bitter. Like I no, think like I broccoli is like one of the few vegetables I'll actually eat. What Just about goddamn asparagus, sweet. dude? I don't like asparagus. Asparagus, dude, you gotta cook it with pepper, uh, pepper, salt, crap. lemon, and garlic. It's great. I don't care. It is horny. Dude, I ate a tasty McDonald's cheeseburger in the last podcast. Ugh. And it was the best. It was the only time I've ever eaten a McDonald's cheeseburger and been like, wow, that's actually really good. Because I was so hungry. <laughs> Any other time, I'm just like, wow, McDonald's cheeseburgers taste like trash. Dude, I wanted to see if a gif. I wanted to see if you could put a gif as your um, uh, like background. Yeah. Um, I'm assuming you can't. And I have one gif, and I forgot what it was, so I tried to make it. And that's what Send it was. Send it uh, to the podcast chat. No, I sent I sent to you over uh, Snapchat because. Oh my god. I don't know. It's better you get to see it like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I, th I thought you could make it, dude. I was gonna make this black man my. <laughs> <laughs> you should get okay. Wallpaper Engine on Steam if you want a gif if if you want a gif as your background. Wait, uh, for no, no, I'm talking about just for like my whole desktop. Yeah. You can do that. Yeah. Right. If you get Wallpaper Engine on Steam, uh, it'll just run in the background, and it'll like change your background to anything you want. How much it does it cost? Money, I don't know. It might be free. I'm not sure. It's three ninety nine, dude. That's too much money. Eh. I don't know. I know Alex has it. I've seen him use it. Personalize your penis. I need to get this black kid off my screen. <laughs> I need to get... Never mind. <laughs> he's, giving me an, he's giving me anxiety. I 
need He's to making get me worried for my life. Get this boy off my screen. I'm gonna get this boy off my screen. <laughs> Dude, don't make me. I'm gonna come everywhere. There's nothing you can do to stop me. Open sessy cock. What can I do to mess with the. Ooh, crispy cream donut! Yo, I could literally make like, my make background. I can make my background on um, goddamn. I can make my YouTube banner channel anything I want, any color I want. Whoa. I can make it gay for all I want. Ew, dude, get off my Snapchat. Ew. God, why do these girls, all these like girls that are. Uh, horny, horny girls? No, like just these thoughts. I want your testicles. On my Snapchat. That I'll post, like, pictures of themselves in the bathtub. Dude, stop. It's like, shouldn't you be showering? Stop talking about me, dude. No, Make like, these girls will be, like, they'll, like, slap on a face mask and then take a shirtless photo in the bathtub, but cutting off the bottom of the photo just to where you can't see anything. And it's, like... Oh, that's happened to me? That's happened to and, me? And before, then they're, like, they girl? put, like, some really dumb quote with a bunch of heart emojis, and it's, like, shouldn't you be bathing? You nasty boy. Um, I bet she smells a little bit. Maybe God, little dude, you bit. smell like feet. I smell like fish. Dude, Aaron wouldn't like that. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Ew, this picture's so ass. Like my ass. Oh, shoot. You're right. Mega, mega ass. <laughs> I love me some of that mega, mega ass. Dude, mega I ass. My profile. My. I'm gonna mess with the quality of the picture though. I'm gonna make it look really bad. Like, mega fish is gonna look like a goddamn Fruit Loop. Oh. Dude, he's gonna be mega red. I've been saying that a lot lately. I've been saying like mega. Dude. Mega dong. Mega cock. What do you want? What do you mean? People have been texting me. Oh. Dude, can we just like take a moment to appreciate the people that actually text back? Hell and yeah. don't just like leave you hanging? Like, you ask them a question and they actually respond to it pretty, like, almost immediately. Yeah. I I have to respond to this person, though, or else I get beat up. <laughs> I think the only person I haven't, I think the only time I haven't, like, responded to somebody right away is because my phone, like, didn't give me the notification. Or yeah. I shouldn't be on my phone during that time. So... Uh, like, I'm, yeah, I'm pretty you, uh, good at texting people back. Yeah, but you didn't to me on Snapchat. Yeah, because I didn't see the notification until like an hour later. Oh, yeah, that's, okay. I just said that's good why excuse. I don't usually... Good excuse. What is that? Good excuse. <laughs> it, I oh, just realized God. what that is. Why? Don't worry about it. <laughs> I just sent that to my girlfriend. I want to see what she Good. Says. <laughs> <laughs> I have a bunch of different ones like that, dude. They all make me horny. <laughs> Shoot, you're right. All right, so I moved. Uh, I moved Dalton to the content creator role. Why? Quit sending me stuff like that. Did you send that to her too? No, I want to though. Probably beat me up. Yeah, quit sending me stuff. Oh, is that the person that you had to respond to right away? Who? Your girlfriend. Yeah. Oh. Dang. She'll probably beat me up. No, I don't think Aaron cares when I don't respond because she does the same thing to me. 
She like won't respond for a full like forty seven thousand hours. So, you know, if I do the same thing back, I don't think she really cares. I care though. Join me in prayer. <laughs> Yes, yeah, stop. Okay, quit sending me stuff. <laughs> I'm trying to text a, a friend, and you're like, somebody called, dude, look at Patrick praying. Join dude, me. Somebody called, somebody called me a Jew, and then I sent them that <laughs> picture, and they were like, oh, yeah, okay. You're not Join me in prayer. <laughs> I sent that to them, and they just got, they were like mega, mega upset. Dude, I'm going to do that. Every time someone, like, calls me a Jew, I'm just going to send them, join me in prayer. <laughs> I outplayed them. That sounds awesome. That's such a great response. It is, don't worry about it. I'm gonna start like doing a movie night in February. Like every huh? month, every month I'm gonna do like a movie night. Here wait, I'm trying when to I, become You wanna hear something I'm stupid? Alex, I texted Alex this idea because, you know, he lives, like, right next to me. So I wanted to, like, know what he thought. I wanted uh, to know what he thought about the idea. Because, you know, he'd probably be at every movie night. So he was, like, I texted him, like, hey, what do you think? I'll actually pull up the text. I was, like, um, what was it? Uh, I want to do a movie night every month, but it would take a while to set up. And he texted back, I don't know if I'd even have time for one, honestly. So I call him later that night, and I tell him, yeah, I want to, like, do a thing where we just watch, like, a few movies, uh, like, uh, one night out of the month. And, like, get drunk. Like, just gather uh, here and just, like, watch a few movies. And he was like, oh, that's what you meant. I was like, what'd you think I meant? And he's like, I thought we were going to meet up every month and make a movie. <laughs> And I was like, where? Oh, I can't hear you right now. Oh, God, dude. I'm so wet. Wait a minute. Uh. Hello? Hey. Hello? Stop. Hello? Hey. Hello? I'm about to scream. Hello? Stop. Hello? Wait. 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 Your Twitter's not going in the description. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Can you put my I tell you this earlier, but... The... Can you put my YouTube channel in the description? If you cut the BS. I want BS. Anyway, uh, the thing with Alex, I was like, where was the disconnect there? That you legitimately thought we were going to film a movie. Dude, you guys were going to get One net rock out of the hard together. <laughs> No, I was just like, dude, we're literally just gonna like meet up and watch like banged. two or three movies or maybe four. Just hang out. But there's gonna be like snacks and like snacks. And there's like, also gonna be movies and some snacks. Damn, she looking like a snack. <laughs> Good. Huh? Good. Fuck you sending me, boy? Dude, You're I'm gonna to send the link to this podcast to your girlfriend. You don't even know who she is. I think I do. Who? I don't know. Exactly. It's Jordan. Yeah, no, it's not. <laughs> this is Desiree. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Nope. Yeah, it is. Dude, can we dox her right now? Her address! <laughs> no! We're not doxing my The first ex. movie night's gonna be, like, around my birthday. And that'll just end up being my birthday party. Are you gonna invite Desiree? I'm gonna invite the conch shell. <laughs> should, I, should I invite Desiree? No! Dude, stop. <laughs> I swear to God. Send me another photo like that again. <laughs> Jesus, dude. I don't want to see that. Stop. I actually get sick to my stomach whenever I see this. <laughs> Do you like, have you like gone onto her Steam profile and read the comments that people no. will leave? 
<laughs> no. People will leave, like, really enjoyable person to play with. It's like a review on her as a person. Like, this person was very enjoyable to play with. I'm gonna go check. Is she friends with you? Um, yeah. But I don't think she goes under the same name anymore. What's her name, Dino? Uh, Dude, I don't even know what your name on... My name is Deckle. Do I gotta fucking look for it's it, dude? Deckle. Can you spell that for me? Deck. Oh. As in L. like E-L. Deckle. Let me find her dumb profile. No, you're not on here. Deckle. Unless you're online right now. I am. Why is there so many of your friends list named Solo a Solo Story? Still can't find it, dude. Have you seen Star Wars The Last Jedi? Mm, no. How? I just haven't. I don't is it even in theaters anymore? I don't know. I feel like it would be out of theaters by now. It's been almost a month. Unless Disney's What's... trying to milk it to the max. What's your thing, do you know? I'm trying to look for it. Are you checking every single one? No, I'm just scrolling through and looking around. That's what I'm doing too. <sighs> I know that if I see it, it'll come to mind. Is it Ack? <laughs> I don't think I so. Fucked I fucked your mom. No. Is it Yayo Kalen? Stop. Uh, to be completely honest with you, she probably changed her name again. To Pickle Rick? <laughs> yeah, I have no idea. Yeah, I'll find her eventually and link it to you. I need it now. I need to bust a nut real quick. Yeah. Is it Crispy Crisco? Maybe Chris she's on Crisco? my Steam friends list. Is it Crispy Crisco? No. Can you stop doxing the people on my friends list? <laughs> I'm literally list? just looking at them, dude. It's public, you idiot. They didn't ask. Dude, you Sex didn't ask. You sexual their lobster. Consent. Gosh dang it, I thought she would have had her freaking... Or maybe she does. Maybe it's because I have streamer mode enabled. What?! Yeah, let me disable streamer mode really quick. I think she Locky has her Steam. Sexy femme. I think she has like her Steam linked on her Discord. Oh, her name is Legally Drunk from No Sleep. I'll link it in the chat. Alright, let me turn back on streamer mode for no reason. I'm looking for it right now. Here you go, filler. It's right there. Anyway, I think we should end the podcast on that note. Pussy. Huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me get it. Ah! Okay. Whoa. <laughs> Stretching. <laughs> All right. Uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this podcast. I'm going to drown Dude, my why dog. Is, why the hell is there a pair of tits on her profile? I'm not questioning it. You should be. Too bad. <laughs> You Hello, dated everyone. this girl. Me, but I don't trade at all. Dude, you should start a podcast. Oh, and I'll be one of the hosts with you. It'll be like this one, except on your channel. <laughs> It'll be called the Operation 19 podcast. Anyway. 19. Anyway, guys. Uh, see ya. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I will probably not have a penis anymore, so thank you.